these fireplaces. Yes, go away. Uh, I got to where the game crashed yesterday. I got past that dialogue box fine. And then I did a safe state there and I hadn't moved on. So we are fleeing. I am dying, personally. <laughs> like for the past few days. Allergies. Yes, we are we are fleeing. Hopefully we won't run into more issue. But no, the game played fine when I had to redo things. Allergies are the worst. Whoa! What the heck is this? Honey, please. It? It's not anything dangerous. Don't be alarmed. Ray, hurry, open the store. And no problem, we're just gonna have a weird cat man lockpick a door in the palace, no problem. Oh. Honey speaks in binary. Navigator code accepted. Activating portal. Drive. I don't want to get into the cult portal. <sighs> she disappeared. Are we supposed to get away with this contraption? gonna do, right? Nina, I think we can make it. Oh. Mother, I'm sorry. But I have to. Don't point your fan at me. Don't talk to me like that, young lady. You are the princess and heir to the throne. Do you think you can just disobey your duty? And your family like this? I love you, mother. I understand how important I am and that I am a princess. But I'm not just a princess. I'm also Nina. And I have to do what I think is right. Bye. Huh? So I get where what house did we get teleported to? Where are we? Hey, honey. What the heck have you done? Let's get out of here and take a look around. And no problem. Allergies sounds like someone didn't eat their local honey. <laughs> you know, I did look at some local honey, but uh, I couldn't bring myself to buy it. We're all the way outside the castle. And no time to waste then. We'd better catch up with Rango and the others. It's only fair I didn't get the apple butter either. <laughs> and so that's what happened. Well, I guess that means we can't be counting on any help from the King of Windy anytime soon. I'm sorry. I don't know what I was thinking. You shouldn't worry about it. More importantly, we should get to the bridge before the king's men do.
Oh my god, I'm so itchy. I think that's the worst part. It's not even the allergies itself. It's just that I am so itchy. Uh, we'll take Carl with us for a bit. He's he's a little behind. Oh shoot! I should have taken uh, Pico actually. That's why I'm gonna swap when I get over there. Pico is the only one that can hit rocks, apparently. His, all, his one use. Oop. I need a Momo as well. For five dollars in that bush. <laughs> oh, we haven't checked on the actual fairies in a little bit either. Hello. We were waiting for you to come. It looks like Momo has learned lots of our secrets. Here's another one. Momo learned charm. Nice. Okay. And I think I have enough gold to get Nina signed up with that other dude once we get over the bridge. Way. This is not the way out. to live in fear of the emulator crashing. <laughs> it just worked. Not a spicy day. But it, not a balanced one either. Uh, allergies, mostly. Rango decided to be an absolute rapscallion today between not wanting his salad and then deciding to give me a heart attack because he didn't want his crickets either. Turns out, they were just too small. Either way, if he keeps giving me reasons to think he's sick, he's going to end up at the vet, and no one wants that.
I'm headed to junk town to buy some machines. I wonder if the boat out of Raphael's running. I think this is just a story. Your offerings offend me. I deserve big fat juicy crickets, mother. Big boys need big crickets, Sir Isaac Newton probably. <laughs> Uh, I'm sure he's fine. He walked around fine. He was in the window fine. Excuse me, passport please. Everything looks okay. You're free to go. Alright. I don't know. I think a lot of it comes from my newness of owning a bearded dragon. I just presume every thing that is out of the norm for him means he's dying. If I was offered a small cricket, I too would be, would be staring out the window, thinking about what could be <laughs> could have been. It it's not my fault. I, I can't help it if the store says large crickets and they're more like medium. <laughs> these are these are things well outside my control. Hey, whoa, there's a house here now. Oop, 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 that wasn't here before. Hello? Help us, help us. Tell us what we should be doing to build our village. You already know what to do, right? Yeah, my paper is here somewhere. Yeah. Oh, I only have one fairy. The fairies go. Yes. <laughs> uh, I have like this slip of paper. It's just scrawlings of a madman. Looks like there's text on this block that I cannot read. <laughs> I wanted to read that, thank you. Oh, death! Two fairies due to food shortage. Shit. <laughs> All right. Huh. I might have to look a little more into the fairy thing. <laughs> oh, that's Rafala. Mm -hmm. Welcome to Rafala, home of the Porter's Guild. I wonder if a uh, skinny dude and the lady got married within the gap of time. I was crazy. <laughs> I 
dad's still down here. Hey there, if you're looking for Ben, he is at the shipyard. Alright. Expected being to be being. Oh, oh, this way, this way. It's Ringo, isn't it? I'm sorry. I haven't done any guild work since I had the baby. If it's guild business, you'll have to talk to Ben. It'd be good if Shadi's kid turned out big and strong. Like me, but they'll probably take after Ben. Oh. Don't be weird. Oh, there he is. I'm sorry, we're looking into it right now. <laughs> I better not have sunk with all my merchandise on it. I'm not talking to him. <laughs> ah, my paper. Back. He's too buff for small spaces. <laughs> That's so sad. He's doing his best. I do like how the uh, party just kind of gets lost from you and then rematerializes. Probably just go that way then. Can I read this stupid block yet? You can't decipher what the characters mean, but you have the strange feeling you seen them somewhere before. Great. Rango still can't read. spooky music here.
Okay. We'll poke around. Sacrifice. Oh. Didn't hurt. Dick. Hello? If you wait and time it right, you can get in and out before the tide. Okay. Hey, you there. The tide's filled up the cave. There's no way to get through. So? Well, I guess we can't go in right now. expensive everything is here. No, I did want to get that for her. Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> yeah, no, for real, for real, no. What the hell happened to the Dollar General? When I first got uh, Holly on my first Leopard Gecko, speaking of the Dollar General, that's where I went to get, like, fake plants, because they were cheaper. <laughs> mm. But now, I bet they'd be as expensive if I went... If I went there, as if I just got them at, like, Michael's. Which is where I've gotten a lot of my fake shrubbery for the children. Because it looks nice. Probably just need to go to the tower, right? I think we were running short on these. Yeah. Top those off again. So it was expensive, but it conveniently lower quality. That should be. That's it's a good slogan, but also awful. I like Buy Below. I had never been in one until I went out to New Jersey to see um, Rev. Because I had never heard of him. It was very cute. I still have like this little vampire keychain I got from there. But then we got one up near the Super Target by me, and it's not the same. It doesn't have, like, nearly as much stuff in it. No. 
You know, it's great, TJ Maxx. I don't get to go very often, but they have the best blankets. This was quite a few years ago before they were in Florida. <laughs> they weren't always down here, or at least not down in my area. Like quite a few years ago, I mean like over 20 years ago, Jesus Christ. Yeah, it would have been before 2017. <laughs> I think like 2010, 2011. I'm like, oh. I'm sorry, but we cannot allow outsiders into our holy site. Please understand. Okay. Maybe I need to go talk to the guy that let us in last time. Mm. There's a Sin City around here somewhere. No, that was somewhere else. It was on the other side of the map. Yeah, it's a it's a game a place in the game. Only it's spelled S Y M because <laughs> of course it is. asleep. Patriarch may look like he's sleeping, but I'm sure he's contemplating the world around him. Y you sure about that? Gar? It's me, Dio. You're still with us? Fear not, Guardian. Evil is no more. It is time for you to rest now. Maybe I just need to walk up to the gate as Gar and not the child. Are you going to the tower, Guardian Gar? Yes. The time has come to return to God what God has given me. Dust to dust. Guardian, do you mean? We thank you. Thank you for your protection all these many years. Rest well, Guardian Gar. Go with God. After the war. After defeating the Brood, their mission. Complete. The Guardians.
I like how that empty treasure box is still there. Offered up to God their victory here. Okay. And God appeared before the uh, the prostrate guardians. I don't want to fight a god. It feels vastly too early in the game to be fighting a god. To reward each and every one of them for their sacrifices and victory over the year. Evil. Not years. Evil. When our mission has been completed. We are allowed to meet our god. Uh-huh. After meeting with God, most guardians return their power to God and fall into a deep sleep. The sleep stone. Deprived of the power granted to him by God, a guardian's body turns to stone. Well, isn't that just fucky? <laughs> He's got a cop attitude for sure. <laughs> So is this like reverse gargoyles rather than them being cursed to be stone and God takes back their favor and you become stone before I enter the sleep of stone. I swear, Rango, that I will take you to meet God. And together. We will learn the truth about God's intentions. You tried and failed, bitch. Yeah, the purple ominous sky does not bode good tidings. Guardian, God will not come here. Fuck, okay. God will not come. Who are you? A triangle. Oh, pyramid. Hey, wait, it's the bitch from earlier. If you want to meet God, you must release me. And you are Diaz. That's probably not how that's said. <laughs> the key, you must seek a guardian geist. Uh. Dias. Wait. Geist is... <coughs> Excuse me, sorry. Did you meet God, Gar? Mm, God is... No. Before that. Before we meet with God. We have to find someone. His name is Geist. I think. Geist? Geist? <laughs> I can't breathe through my nose. It's kind of a problem. <laughs> mm. Like me, he's a guardian. A guardian? You mean just like you, Gar? I don't know exactly what we should do, but... We should be able to find out something about Geist if we ask at Urkan Tampa. Tapa? Urka Tapa. Tippity Tapa. Ugh. I just feel bad I keep sniffling in my microphone. I don't mean to. It is not my intention.
what happened. Guardian, I thought you were going to enter the stone sleep. I see. Well, come back whenever you're ready, then. Well, it's not that he wasn't ready, it's the god said no. I like how if there's not enough space, I can't become Gar. Oh, maybe. I didn't try, I didn't go to the other side of the pyramid. But because Gar said to go back to Tipitapa. Guardian Gar. Are you- are we gonna have this conversation every fucking time I come here? <laughs> Why doesn't Gar have pants? He has a shirt. Why well, have a shirt if you don't need pants? Why is he Donald ducking it? Oh, he can't fit. <laughs> I think it's more of a symbolic thing with the robes and prayer beads. I mean, you could wear the prayer beads and not the robes. I mean, he already had to... Those have to be custom-made robes. How else would he have his wingies through the back? I say robe, but it's a shirt. Uh, might not let me there we go there's a woman lying beyond the veil of light and I can't do anything with it but here she is wearing prayer beads would be weird though would bump this game to a rated M2 <laughs> could you have a Shalon monk without their orange robes okay it must not be time yet well, a Shaolin monk isn't a dragon. It's just a guy. It would be weird if a guy was walking around in just prayer beads. I mean, if that's your thing, you do you, man. <clears throat> Anyhow, you're trying to tell people what to do, but... I just want to know why he's Donald Ducking it. That's it. Clearly he got custom made robes. Oh shit. Well that was fucking rude. The end of my thought there is he could have gotten custom made pants too. <coughs> you cunt. Yes, I think it heals you for like 20 hit points. I have to sleep in an inn. Fuck. Yeah, I was right. It is 20. Haha. <laughs> God took his balls so he has nothing to hide. I don't fucking know. Well, he's... Mm. <laughs> you know what? I'm, no. Pivoting. We're walking away from this conversation now. Well, 
if he's a lizard dragon guy, it's all internal anyway, right? I don't need to be in here. Oh, shit. What's this now? Sorry, my phone went off. That was... <laughs> okay, cool. Cool appetite. I would like to leave, please. I don't want to leave. On that same vein of thought, that means Gar sheds. Cerberus guys are fucking annoying, Jesus. so funny that if there's not enough space you cannot be gar <laughs> maybe i have to go talk to the old man actually do not let me leave this town without sleeping at the end <laughs> uh, what is it your mission is over Veneer Venerable Patriarch. <laughs> God did not appear in the tower. That's because you still have doubt in your heart. You must free yourself from your doubts. Unless you wish to become like Geist. Venerable one. Do you know where Geist is? Please tell me, O oh Patriarch. I must meet with Geist before I can be free of my doubts. Beyond the cave by. Th oh, now we can go to the fucking cave. Okay. Beyond the cave by the sea to the west. I've heard there lives a guardian who has given up fighting. Bagar, you cannot allow yourself to become like Geist. Keep your faith. Do not doubt the wisdom of God. Sleep before you go to the cave. <laughs> Thank you. All right, we're gonna go sleep. Take a big nap. Well, they're gonna sleep. I'm gonna drown in snot. <laughs> Ugh. Big heck and Z's. If I can walk up this fucking plank. Nope, don't need to go up that one. Actually, it's the store. I hate this town and everything it stands for. But it's so hard to navigate. Let me sleep. Uh, yeah, he's a bit blundering.
I saw a video today of congestion relief to you. Must be a sign. <sighs> That's the sad part. This is me on, like, allergy medicine. I'm like the, this is you, this is your brains on drugs commercial, but there's no difference between me on or off the drugs. <laughs> it's just a smashed egg in a pan. <coughs> I feel like a smashed egg. Murder. If you wait and time it right, you can get it. Yeah, thank you. Don't explode on me. Ugh. Oh, jeez, don't. That's weird. Yes, it was. There's so much. So, this place is so big. Oh my god, look at him. Look at this stupid little frog. I love him. That. Why is there a fish head in the box? It's gross. <laughs> no, I love him. He's so cute. I know. Sometimes the walls are weird in this game. Oh. I am confusion. Uh, how do I... That is significantly less cute, but still a cool sprite. You didn't need to get bigger. Uh-oh. The ebb of the tide has changed the sea level. 
Alright, well that's probably a problem for me. I definitely really like all the sprite work in this game. It had to be such a tedious thing to make, like, all the enemies in different perspectives. These are my favorite little dudes. I like I like their stupid face. I like the colors they used. I like the little noise they make. They make me very happy. not the same door I came in. Um, I can check the other way. I like the tongue waggle they do when they attack. I imagine one huge feel feed a whole family too. Probably. I don't know. Well, some people eat frog. Release the legs. I don't know. Do people eat the whole frog or is it just the legs? I think actually I don't know. I've only seen frog legs, but I've seen people eat whole frogs on Naked and Afraid. I don't think Naked and Afraid counts. That is eating something under duress. That's my dilemma, I'm gonna just say legs. <laughs> yeah, I don't think eating something under duress counts as a proper wanting to eat something. I don't know, people eat sentry eggs. That's safe. People eat pool frog.
So apparently frog legs are the only part of the frog that are edible. <laughs> under duress? <laughs> Do you only eat under duress? That's unfortunate, but also highly relatable. <laughs> But yeah, frog legs are apparently the only thing that are edible on a frog. I found a coin. I'm also very lost because I thought that was going to take me back to where I was before. So says Google anyway, but Google's AI also is telling people to add non-toxic glue to make their cheese stick to their pizza. So, <laughs> your mileage may vary. What was this back there game? Star almost dead. When did this happen? Yeah. Okay, this is where we were. Sorry, excuse me. Oh, there goes the tide again. I do wish there was a repel or something. I don't like his very human looking feet. He probably also shouldn't be showing those for free. Yes. 
Yeah, okay, we have to wait for the water to go down and to get down there. That's fine. Where are my workers? Murder! Took me back across. I wonder if it's a timer for the water to go down or if it's based on how many steps I take. It does sound like a zero question, but I think zero just got freed from work. I think it's based on enemy interactions on screen away from the water. Okay. Then we'll just duck back into the door. Murder some guys. Then I'm gonna duck in here and go blow my nose real quick. That sneeze fucked me up. Give me a minute. with the mild ability to be able to breathe. Will that last? No. My was took the whole <laughs> must have been good off. Flame <sighs> was just dying. Think of me fondly. No, oh, it was convenient. <laughs> uh, remember, I once lived, as this is surely going to kill me. to sleep. I'm just taking a nap. Now he's taking a very permanent nap. Where's this go now? Okay. <clears throat> Another cave. Oh, more. That's a shocker. Now let's go look at that first cave. Spooky dokey spooky. Does that mean I can drown in here?
I would prefer to not drown. Outright kill me, but still. And then, oh, that's a door. Okay. Um, okay. Uh, it's fine, Big Potato uh, told me. I wasn't sure how long it took for the water to rise or fall. And apparently it's dependent on enemy encounters away from the water. I'm sitting on a surplus of healing items. Oh! It's a dead guy. Pox ring. Can I have one of those? What do we got? Titan belt. Oh, surprise attack. Okay. That can stay in the inventory. It's fine. So we checked both those. We'll go out the door. It's very kind of the game to not drown me in this cave. Meow. I just really like the colors of these guys. Does this leave me now? Oh, we're on the other side. All right, that's a ladder. Where's the ladder go? Well, if that's that, then what's on the other side? Hold on. You know, this whole time I kept thinking that said croc tear, but I think it says croc tar. And that I have more questions. What is that? Oh, it is tear. Chance of restoring status. Okay. What's the fish head? Oh. There you go, Rango. Okay. 
It's just like how I have a taser in my inventory. There. Over here, but I want to go the other way. Because I know this leads to a ladder. So we'll come back. What's over here? exploding on me is going to seal up. Please kill it. Thank you. <laughs> you found a deadly blade. Ooh, fancy. Maybe fancy? No, well, not for me. Probably for... Um... Catman do. Ray William Johnson. Ooh, Gar learned Gambit. Okay, so up the ladder we go now. Jimmy. Oh good, more cave. It's my favorite. <laughs> uh, just in case. Oh, hello. Gib. Rango, here's the voice of the brood sealed in the chrism. You found the Gross gene? Okay. Am I just gonna turn into a gloopy dragon? Oh, 
of map. I was expecting there to be a boss. There was not a boss. Actually, hold on. <laughs> hold that thought. We're gonna sleep. And we're gonna save. We're not gonna be stupid. Okay. But it sounds gross. Ugh. So the force gross thorn would make it incredibly powerful. Uh -huh. Okay, now that I've saved and slept. Howdy. Are you fellas on the lamb too? You sure don't look like it. This here's Cliff. It's a place for the homeless and jobless and other dropouts. Great. No, I didn't want to go back in. This is where all I, uh, all them folks that don't fit in somewhere else comes to be. Ugh, oh, jeez. Like me, hee hee hee. Okay. Oh, thorn would decrease your hit points. Gross. What do you want, eh? Looking for someone? Okay, it's at the end of the village. Hehe. <laughs> I'm pretty sure these guys all speak with a Cockney accent, but <laughs> I don't think that's going to happen, considering I just cannot breathe out of my nose. Rest here. I don't need to, thank you. Also, I feel like if I slept here, you guys would rob, run my pockets. So. We're not gonna do that. Oh no. It's a guy. Who's there? Guardian guys. Gar. <laughs> That's fine. A prodigy of the progeny of the brood. Is that him? At God's command, we killed the brood. I want to know if that was a mistake. And he's the key that mis to that mystery. Are you still talking that nonsense? If you doubt the word of God, you should just run away. Run away like I did. What were you thinking anyway? Bringing him here like this. You want to help him avenge the brood? He's only one little boy. What do you think he can do all alone. Well, he's not little. I just want to know the truth. Why did the brood have to die? 
You haven't changed, have you? Asking those stupid questions. Anyway. Listen here, fucker. I am a big boy. I'll turn you to ash. <laughs> so. What does the high and mighty Gar want with me? We need you to free Diaz. Dice? Dice? Yeah. Desi? Diaz isn't right, because the I and the E would have to be flipped. Not sure what this one. So we can meet with God. We need... Desi's help? I guess we'll go with Desi. A Desi, -er. I suppose I'm the right one to talk about that. To talk to about that. I think it's these. Maybe? All right, I'll help you. But before I do, I want to have a little chat with our dragon friend here. Alone. I'll kick your ass. Hello. I'm sure you've heard from Gar about how we guardians fought the brood. We killed countless brood. Something I feel really bad about now, but it's all over and done with. Unless you want to dig up all the skeletons of the past. That's what I thought. That's the way the brood always were. Even though they had such power, they didn't fight back. The world thinks that it was the brood that started the war. But they didn't. We hunted them down and killed them. Eventually, I couldn't take it any longer, so I ran away. Gar kept his faith in God and fought to the end, but... I bet somewhere deep in his heart he had his doubts. So, you see... It's not that I don't understand what he's feeling, but... I was never as serious as he is. I don't care about God or the truth. It's too much trouble for me to bother with, you know? That's why I want you to think this. I think this over. Talk about it with Gar outside there. And if you're really serious, if you really want to do this, come back here alone, all right? All right, now get out of here. Okay. Okay. Before or after I talk to Gar? Well, uh, I guess it has to be after I talk to Gar. Unless you mean save state, because I can do that too. Here. Well, here. <laughs> We'll cheat. <laughs> there you go. What happened? Hmm, I said that. I think maybe he wants to test you, Rango. As long as I've known him, Geist doesn't do anything until he's convinced himself it's what he has what has to be done. He probably wants to know how serious you are about this whole 
business. Just how far you just how far you're meant to take it. What do you think, Rango? Your strength. The blood in your veins. Your desire to know the truth. I'm not the one who wants to meet God. Don't put this on me. That's you. The truth about God. Is it enough to convince Geist? These guardians are always trying to send you to God. Gar failed. <laughs> then you have nothing to worry about. Once you've prepared yourself, you should go meet Geist. Oh, well, now I can save, like, a real person. But I think I healed. And I bought. Yeah, I'm healed. Uh, where was the. Yeah, was it this one? Me? No, not you. Not you at all. Who's this one? Don't steal my shit, please. sell things. Nothing I need, though. Okay. We slept. We saved. Car failed. Guys will fail, too. <laughs> they will beat his ass. Well, then, have you made up your mind? Yeah. Huh. I thought you'd say that. I had you figured as the serious type. Well, then, shall we begin? Go over there. Stand between the two brazers. That's fine. All right, now. Frost gross force. This may seem old-fashioned to you, but it's the only thing I know how to do, okay? I need you to fight me, little dragon. Oh, no. He turned into a big thing. Oh, okay. Oh, the torches are also? Okay. Frost. Gross force. Corona? <laughs> you can't be saying shit like that. Owie! All right, it doesn't matter. Different age people. Oh, those torches gotta go, huh? fire.
easy done. <laughs> So this is the dragon's true strength. You see the seal that keeps uh, D's. Yeah, D's. Trapped. Couldn't be released. As long as I was alive, so this was the only way. But don't feel bad. I died the, 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 I died the day I became a guardian. Besides, during the war, I killed so many dragons. It seems only fair. That in that I in turn have my life taken by the brood. Yeah. No wonder. Is this power what God feared? That is a lot to put on a kid. Guys. Or is the real power of the brood? The ability to make allies out of enemies. I, yes, he is. He is wearing pants. <laughs> it's too bad it had to be this way. I would have liked to go with you. Gar, it's up to you now. That is so much to put on a kid. Geist understood. With this, Dee should be free. I don't feel bad, Mr. Stark. Let's go. Let's go to meet God. <laughs> Fuck. Well, well. Looky who made it back in one piece. Thank you, Blitz. Oh, check the ashes? Okay. <laughs> Let's rob his corpse. Oh, no, the ashes are gone. Oh, well. Unless it's something I really need, I can always redo the fight. about it. <sighs> Besides, I have enough money now to upgrade Gar's weapon. So I will walk over here and do that. Houses, it's loads down there. I'm on the wrong level. Skip this weapon, or skip the weapon off of uh, guys. Okay. Give a looky loo. There we go. There's a house near I Drunk City.
Rude. How does one become a guild member? Oh, it might be. Um, yeah, it's probably down there. And we can't go there yet. Soon, maybe. But this, you should be freed. Let's get back to the tower. Geist would. No, never mind. I would like to sleep, please. Hooray, just what I always wanted. Freeing... Freeing people from pyramids. Oh, man. Oh, nope, nope, no, wrong way. Angel Tower, let's go. Free the lady. Free the spooky bitch. And or take two steps and have to fight things. That's not equally acceptable, I suppose. <laughs> Spider-Man pose. Dees. Guardian, come closer. Oof! <laughs> okay. You big oaf, you boneheaded guardian. What do you think you were doing? Entombing me in this temple for 500 years? I have half a mind to blast you into orbit. <laughs> oh, buddy. <laughs> So, I guess the fact that you've released me shows that you're finally willing to listen to what I have to say. Jesus. It's too late, idiot. <laughs> well, maybe not completely hopeless. <laughs> Ringo wishes to leave, please. What have you done? Oh, was she a snake? What do you think you're doing, you buffoon? Idiot. Why does she have legs now? But our god has told us that they were wicked. And you never thought she might be wrong, you imbecile? I'll take you to meet your fool god. Show more respect for our god or else. They really threw her in a prism and took her tail? 
If each and every last member of the brood had indeed been killed, all would have been lost. But there's still one of the brood left. And what of God? First things first, Guardian. The spirits of the dead dragons are too strong here. We need to go someplace else. There should be a cave at the base of the volcano to the west of here. I'll meet you there. Oh, probably the room where I can't reach shit. The, vol the volcano to the west. Got it, my little dragon. Okay. The volcano to the west. She must mean Mount Zublo. Wait just a minute. Why do you have such a goofy look on your face, Rango? Gee, I don't know. He's 17. <laughs> you fucking think? Right? It probably is his first time seeing an exposed titty. <laughs> Get off his back. <laughs> he didn't sign up for any of this. So. You gotta say some specific things here. Okay. Okay. I think this is the place D's meant. Oh! <laughs> Into the void. There you are, my little dragon. Ah, now she's normal. Don't be frightened. This is what I really look like. Were you expecting me to show up naked again? In that form, the one I was imprisoned in, I'm not able to fully utilize my powers, see? Well, thanks. You certainly know what to say to a lady, don't you? So, now that you're all here, is this where we'll meet God? No, silly. I'm going to tell you how to get there from here. Before I was imprisoned, I would have been able to take you there myself, but I don't have enough strength left to do it now. <coughs> Sorry, excuse me. All right, my little Ringo. I'm going to open your eye, so you'll be able to see the way yourself. It might hurt a little, but you'll just have to grin and bear it. A little, she says.
My Ringo. That Ringo is called Piranha? The Eye of God. If you follow that light, you'll find the God who used the Guardians to destroy your people. North? Far, far away to the north. Across the sea. How you get there is up to you. I can't do it for you. This is all I can do now. It's up to you now, Ringo. Good luck. Gar, I want you to look out for him. Make sure nothing happens to him, understand? I swear by the lives of all the brood. I stole. He will come he will not come to harm while I'm while I draw breath. I can read real good. Whew. I must be getting old if something like this knocks the wind out of me. You must be feeling your age as well. Sister. Ringo, Gar. Who's sister? First Rango. Then Yugar. Just disappeared like that. It was so frightened. What happened? Did you see Dees? Did you meet God? God is very far away. Across the sea. Looks like we'll be needing a boat. Okay, smokey dokey. I never got Nina acquaint or uh, apprenticed with that guy. She's still apprenticed with Grandpa, and I feel like I want to do that before we gallivant across the sea. I don't have the money though. Shit. All right, let's head across the map at least. this area okay hey. Hey. it's gonna take me forever to get the money Thank you. 
up here, right? Yep. Woke up to a spider crawling up my bicep. Uh, also, a kid opening my store when I should have closed two hours ago. <laughs> That's not great. Oh, this is working. Where does it take me? Oh, back to the palace. That's interesting. Oh, I played Minecraft. <laughs> this is another portal. Oh, interesting. So it didn't take me back to where I was. So, fun fact, I've never actually played Minecraft. So will it just take me between those two points? Looks like, yeah, no, never played Minecraft. Motherfucker. I didn't tell you to go down. I don't know. A zero. How important is it for me to apprentice Nina to the guy who wants all of the money? <laughs> Excuse me. You give off veteran Minecraft vibes. I feel deceived despite being promised nothing. <laughs> yeah, no, I never played it. Thank you. So if it's not important to apprentice her to the guy, I'm not going to worry about it. If it is, I will worry about it. Because usually when games are like, you have to ride a boat to get to a place, you're not going to come back to the original place for a while. I knew people who played Minecraft. I know who Steve is. And the creepers. And they're zombie dudes. <sighs> Zero got kidnapped. have a match. Oh, what is this? Did I ever look at this? Oh, it's a coffee shop. Yeah, I did look at that. Zero. I was asking, um, how important is it to apprentice Nina to the guy who wants, like, all of my money? 
Because I can either grind for the gold and make sure she gets apprenticed before we get on the boat, or I can just go deal with the boat stuff. No, I never gave him my money. I literally never had the money to give him. Yes, I did forever go sleep in the end. That's what I'm saying about it. Because I've never had the money, it's either I grind for it now and do it before the boat, or we let it go. I'm pretty sure I didn't. Pretty sure I tried and you told me I was poor. So I fucked off. <laughs> 